What's going on everyone? It's Jamie here from SAS University and let's talk about some really good SAS books and general business books that you should be reading as an entrepreneur if this is your first SAS journey or you've been experienced. These books cover a wide range of topics. They can help you go from idea to generating your first SAS product. They can also give you some good outlooks on what it's like to be an entrepreneur and a SAS founder. Before I dive into it, I just want to talk about the Solo SaaS Academy. It's going to be my very own course on how you can create a SaaS business from scratch where you learn everything from idea generation to generating your first $1,000 a month in MRR. And I'll take everything that I've learned over the last few years as a solo SaaS founder and packaging it into a very easy to understand course where I give real world examples of my very own SaaS businesses so you can take that into your own and learn from my mistakes and my successes. This course is still in development, but there's a link in the description below to apply for early access. And that's gonna guarantee you a discounted rate when the course does come out as well. So again, there's a link in the description below so make sure you hit apply now and that's going to bring you to a short survey to fill out. So let's dive into our first book today and that's going to be Product-Led Growth, How to Build a Product That Sells Itself it's by Wes Bush. And they do a really good job at explaining how to build successful products, really how to get value to your product to the customer quickly so they become a lifelong user of your product. They have some really good examples here, taking from stories across different SaaS companies, overall a really good way to understand product development and how to build a really good product here. Some great testimonials, they must read for SaaS founders. Next, let's take a look at Make, it's the Indie Maker Handbook here. Overall, they've sold over 15,000 or just shy 15,000 copies. There's a 50% off discount going on at the time of recording as well. Overall, amazing reviews here. The author of this book is the founder of Nomad List, and he takes a lot of his experiences here, puts it in the book. They go over quite a few things as well, coming from different ideas, from idea to building, growing, to exiting and automating certain parts of your business. He is a one person founder and has a small team, but has been able to scale up his SaaS business tremendously. The next one's gonna be the mom test. This one's gonna be more of idea generation. It's gonna be how to talk to your customers and learn if your business idea is good before actually building something. Now it's super easy to just ask your friends and family what they think of your business idea. And most of the time they're gonna say it's great and that you should go for it. This book does a great job at structuring those questions to make sure that you're actually validating your idea properly. Overall, an extremely popular book, especially among SaaS founders. Next, let's take a look at Blueprints for a SaaS Sales Organization. Now, this one's more broad here, and it does focus on it can build your existing company into a more SaaS focused company, but it does a great job of explaining some key metrics here and costs you should be watching out for. It's not a very long book as well, which is really nice, as it really gets straight to the point. One example of that is the customer retention cost, it's CRC. This is going to be different from your customer acquisition cost, but it's something to think about here. How much does it cost to actually retain your customers to service them over time as I think that's something a lot of founders ignore rather they just focus on the acquisition costs so how much ad spend did it take and I think that's a great thing to look at and something you should be considering next we'll take a look at the lean product playbook how to innovate with minimal viable products and rapid customer feedback this is by Dan Olson, and it's a practical guide to building products that customers love. It's quite a good pyramid framework here on how to actually build an MVP, what features to include, how to decide on your target customer, and how to actually test that. He uses a lot of real world examples from products he has built at different companies and how they go about this process. And I think it's a great one to provide insight into how to companies do it and how you can do it on your own smaller scale. The next one is going to be Lean Analytics, is how to use data to build a better startup faster. This book is great because it gives you ideas on how to tap into different analytics. I think a lot of founders are more gut led here. And you may think you know what a customer wants, but being able to use analytics can make the process so much more efficient as you're using actual data rather than just thoughts and feelings when building your product. So now we'll dive into our last book here. This one's more of a general book here, but it is one that has influenced a lot of entrepreneurs, and that's going to be the four hour work week. Now, though, you can take the information with a grain of salt as you probably won't want to be working a four hour work week but it does go a lot into how to organize your life where you're not working all the time where you're outsourcing using geographical arbitrage although many of the tactics in this are outdated it has a good overall view here it is a little bit polarizing with the title but overall just a general aspirational book too in just terms of the life he lived for that brief period where he was working four hours a work week and it's something a lot of founders want to do as they want to be able to travel and work from anywhere so this will conclude the video here we're going over several different books compile this list let me know in the comments what you think of these books and if you think any other ones should have been included i want to mention the solo SaaS academy again where you learn everything from idea generation to your first one thousand dollars a month in mrr There's 
a link in the description below to get access to the course where you can get a guaranteed rate when the course does release. So this is going to conclude the video here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in our next video.